First, we will receive a machine, a screen, 10 treatment heads, three handle pieces, a wire, and a pedal. Next, we try to install the screen. Open this box, and then you will see that there is a display screen. For the screen, this black part pulls down, and then we back to face the screen. It looks like after aligning the black part in the groove, insert it down and press it. Remember to see that this place is flat, so the screen is finished. Next, we install the flat handle piece. Place the handle piece in this groove. And then, connect the handle plug to any picture with a flat handle shape. The same method is used for the other flat hand. Next, we install the booster handle piece. Place the booster handle piece up and connect the handle plug to the interface with the booster graphic. The connection must be inserted firmly in place. Next, we connect the pedal. Connect the plug to the last remaining interface and tighten the screws. Now, we install the treatment heads. Open the treatment head and install it. Pick up the handle. Install the treatment head on the handle and clap it firmly. The same for the treatment head on the other side. Then, let's connect the wire. Install the booster treatment head. Pick up the booster handpiece. Find the interface of the booster handpiece and the booster treatment head. And then, Connect them according to the interface alignment. Before operating the customer, first, we should wash the customer's face with facial cleanser. After washing, prepare an eyebrow pencil and draw the operating area. Ask the client to turn her face sideways. Find an outline of the client's face and draw a line connecting the highest point to the end behind the ear. For the second line, draw a line along your finger, one finger away from the corner of her mouth. For the third line, draw a line along your finger, one finger away from her ear. For the fourth line, draw the outline of the apple cheek. Then, use the scale on the treatment head to divide the line into several equal parts, and then connect them.
the below area that we have already drawn it. In the second area, we draw a line from the highest point of the eye back as the center, all the way to the temple area. When we operate on the crow's feet area, we use the triangular area of our crow's feet as the center point and the draw strips to connect it. The temple area, the ear area, and the highest point of our apple cheek are restricted areas and cannot be operated. And then we connect it. Regarding the forehead, draw a line connecting the eyebrow tail and the eyebrow peak at the highest point. And then draw a line connecting the hairline area with the fear trim as the center. The restricted areas and the triangle areas cannot operate. The second step is to start the operation. First, we take out the 4.5 cartridge. This is for smart layer. Install the treatment head and adjust the energy from the lowest level according to the energy value that the customer can accept. Before operation, adjust the energy from 0.3 Joule and apply medical code gear evening to the operation area. We need to stick closely to the skin, and we need to stick closely between the lines. Also, we need to ask customer whether she feels it. If the customer doesn't feel anything, we need to increase the energy according to the customer's acceptable energy range. The operation method is in the form of stamping. The range of movement must be small to ensure that each area needs to be operated in place and close to the skin. Ask the customer how it feels. We operate these three areas first. The operation method is the same as previous one. After the operation is completed, we align this corner with this line. The third step is to focus on this method muscle to lift it here and start the operation here. Be sure to apply it close to her skin. Lift this fat to the apple cheek area. After the operation is completed, we will strengthen the last step, which can be slide here. Be sure to stick tightly when sliding. In the last step, we operate the area of apple cheek and the nasal labia folds. We can also push it in this way, or we can push it from the inside out according to the comfort level of our own technique.
the second line will also start to be lifted from this place. This area can do lifting too. We should lifting up to highest, then stop. This area cannot do it because these are restricted area. The second step, after we use 4.5 cartridges, then we can use 3.0 cartridge, do wrinkle removal on dermis. The treatment way is same as 4.5 cartridges. Also, lifting from this area, no need to move quickly. We must pay attention to stick to the client's skin and operate the highest point of the area. The treatment way of second line is same. The other hand can be used to assist lifting the skin. The third line is pushed up from this position. Energy is same. We should adjust the energy from low to high. The treatment way is same too. When we do treatment, we can ask customer's feeling. If customer feel a little hot on the face, the energy is enough. The third step, we are targeting the epidermal layer. The treatment way is same as the previous two steps. The energy is adjusted from the lowest level to the energy that the customer can accept. The method is same, all at an angle. After the operation, this area is moved towards here. The nasal labia folds are pushed out from the inside out. And the final step is to strengthen this area. Now we have finished operating three areas. The remaining one area is the forehead. For the forehead area, we use 1.5 cartridges. And we only can use 1.5 cartridges to this area. And must put cooling gel. And remember, the cooling gel must more, cannot be less. The energy is also the same and cannot be too high. Start from the lowest and adjust it according to the customer's acceptance range. The operation method is the same. Go up from here. Take this as the center. Smooth out this forehead wrinkle. The last step is to operate the crow's feet area. And we choose 2.0 cartridge. Attention! Other treatment has cannot be used. The energy is the same. Let's start from 0.3 Joule. Open your hands and be sure to apply cold gel during operation. The thread should not be too close to the eyeball. Focus on the middle and move to both sides. Repeat several times. After the operation, the second step is to push out balls. The last step is to strengthen. The mode energy is the same, based on the customer's acceptance range value. The mode we choose is the MP mode. There should be a lot of gel, and it must be close to the skin. Apply it downwards and slide it to bring the fat here. Strengthening is done in this way. In this area and this area, we operate 4.5 and then use 3.0 and 1.5. The treatment way is the same. After we just use the three treatment halves, we can choose our booster handle, make another stress and mold. We choose a 4.5 treatment head. The energy is also adjusted from low to high. The customer accepts the range value. 
This needs to be controlled by the foot pedal to control the output. During operation, we use half circle. Be sure to remember to put cooling gel. So that after reaching this point, the second line must be close to the skin. The same is here too. Just push up from the fat hair. We can also slide treatment from here later. We push the cartridge from the inside out in the nasal labial fold area. Just like this. And repeat several times. This kind of droppy area on the face must be treated several times like this. Here we are using a 4.5 cartridge in dot mode. Now we use the more intensive mode in the 3.0 cartridge. We choose MP mode and the energy is adjusted from the lowest. Operate as before. We must pay attention to being close to the skin during the operation. Next, we change to the 4.5 cartridge. Use the dot mode, adjusting the energy from the lowest, and then start. During the treatment, we need to use enough cold gel and keep it close to the skin. Every time we complete a shot, we move about half a circle from button to top. After arriving here, we start the second treatment area. From here, after completing the first shot, move half a circle. And be careful not to move too much. The third treatment area is also the same as before. After completing the three areas, we can use MP mode. We can use the slide method to treat. Steer from button to top and complete the treatment of three areas. Be sure to stick the skin. We choose the 3.0 cartridge and install it. We choose the dot mode. The operation method is the same as that of 4.5 cartridge. The last step, we use the 4.5 cartridge and install it. The operation is still the same as before. The energy is adjusted from the lowest. Body treatment. First, we draw an operating area map for the customer. We should know that. The navel area is a restricted area and cannot be treated. In addition, some clients who had a caesarean section must avoid treatment in the scar area. The method of drawing a line is We draw a line in this area, a finger's distance from the ribs downward. The second step is to select the cartridge according to the customer's obesity level. For customers who are obese, we choose cartridge with deeper penetration, such as 13-point cartridge. We put the gear on the client's abdomen, and there must be more gear. The third step is to use dot mode and adjust the energy. We start from the lowest energy and adjust it according to the range that the customer can accept. During operation, you can ask the customer if they feel anything. If they don't feel anything, adjust the energy value to the level that the customer can accept. The fourth step is the operation method. We start it from the button, just like stamping, and move slowly. Each area operates the same way. The fifth step, we use MP mode 
and the operation method is the same. It's just like stamping, but you cannot move it too much. We use this position as a starting point. Use the sliding treatment method to the left and slide the handle from the inside out. The sixth step, we ask the customer to lie on his side and use this area as a starting point to treat it first with the stamping method and then with the slide method. Next, we change to a 9.0 cartridge. The operation method is the same as the 13.0 cartridge. Finally, after completing the operation of the 9.0 cartridge, we change the cartridge to a 6.0 cartridge. The operation method is exactly the same as 13.0 and 9.0.